Hello everyone, my name is Dark Ravnik and welcome back to another Shipyard Showcase. Today we're looking at the Exploration HQ done by Parker Server. And it is another mobile base, but on wheels, kind of like mine. But perhaps this is cooler, because for a start, this is modless. For another, this is smaller. That could be cool. That could be very cool. It's got everything you need for a base. It's got refineries. The assemblers it's got med bays. It's got assemblers. It's got refineries. I think I'm repeating myself. It's got stuff. It's gonna be awesome. Let's take a closer look. Okay, first thing we gotta say is your refineries. It's got all the modules on it that it needs. Yeah. Oh, actually, let's just double check to make sure. Uh, yeah, your modules, your modules. Yeah, everything you need. Oh, it's got these cool little mobile. Exploration craft? Is that what they are? Uh, do they have like, um, oh, a little, uh, <laughs> deposit detectors on them? I gotta check. Uh, what's this do? Uh, this is turn on, advanced rotor detach, advanced rotor attach. It's got a detector, yes. Now let's try, um, turn on. And this is de detach, right? Yeah. Okay, so we detach. Oh! <gasps> Well, that's an interesting docking module now, isn't it? Uh, why can I not move backwards? Can I not move backwards with this thing? Oh, okay. It can only move forwards. No backwards. Isn't that a little dangerous? Meh. Does a job. Okay, so. Haha, <laughs> this is cool. So you got your little detector on, and you got your little antenna on. And then when you're done, you turn around and come to a complete stop. And then you return back. Can, uh, can I reconnect? I should be able to. I mean, technically speaking, it's just a rotor, right? But on the other hand, without actual stopping thrusters, this could be a little on the difficult side. Uh. Yeah. Okay, we'll just lower ourselves down. Okay, how close am I to stopping in the right spot? Okay. Rotate around. Hmm. Stopping here could be a little on the difficult side. Okay. Wait, am I touching it? What am I doing? Oh, oh no, 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 don't, don't, don't. Oh, God. Oh god, oh god, no, 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 no. Okay, parking this thing is exceedingly difficult. <laughs> Maybe I'm doing this wrong. Maybe I could use gravity to do it. Gravity is a friend, right? Okay, and now, now can I... Is this correct? Now, if I just do... Attach? Is that not attached? A attach? Uh oh. Nope, 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 nope. Reverse, 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 reverse. Yeah, gravity can help! Gravity's my friend! Now can I attach? Uh oh. Gravity's no longer my friend! I hate you, gravity! <laughs> Am I now in the right spot? Stop. Okay. Slowly rotate, slowly rotate, slowly rotate, and maybe I sideways in? Okay, gravity's being a bitch. <laughs> I don't know how to reconnect. <laughs> I get the feeling that if you want to do this yourself without having to fight with the thing for ages and ages, you might want to put on thrusters that help you. Doink. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. Now that we've had our trouble finding our way to reconnect to that thing. Let's see, we got your med bay. That's always a useful thing for mobile base. Something I've kind of left out on my mobile base, but hey! <laughs> we got... How many turrets? Is it just one turret? I suppose that's okay, because you know, those little annoying pests, they tend to not be too powerful, right? Right? <laughs> we got ourselves sunroofs. Everyone loves a sunroof. We've also got a little door here. Easier entry if you have like say a foot ramp or something like that. And boop. 
Ooh. So we got control station here. Oh, we got a cryo chamber. Control station is. What is the purpose? Is it control station? Okay, we got refineries on off, assemblers, H2O, and bacon. We've got bacon. Okay. So this is how you drive then, huh? Wait, can I? I wonder. If I go out here. Can I actually get to that from here? Oh, so close. So close. And it sent me out. Okay, okay, okay. So, um. What, why am I not? Oh, here we go. I was wondering why it wasn't driving for a moment there. This is pretty cool. Does it have a gyroscope on it? Gyro, gyro, because gy there we go. We got gyro. Wait, is it on? I didn't see gyro. Yeah, it's on. It's on. Yeah, yeah. Because gyros are always a very important thing with these things. You never know when things might get tilted wrong. You know what I mean? It's got some decent speed to it too, eh? It's obviously got a um, power limiter to it, 20 meters per second. No thrusters. That's no problem, although it does make weird noises like it's got thrusters. You kind of like listen to them and expect thrusters. What are those things on the side there? Let's take a look. What are they? Oh! Oh, that is so cool. The wheel suspensions are inside out and they look freaking awesome. Oh my god, I'm like, what is those weird looking blocks? But that is so cool. Oh, you can actually phase them through blocks like that? Oh. Okay, well, let's give this a drive. See how well. It... Um. Oh, okay, I got to mash spacebar to get moving again. Let's see how well it take driving up like cliffs and stuff like that. Be interesting to see. And if possible, I might, you know, be able to just, you know, wheels. Wheels. Just, you know, increase the power if I need to, right? Okay, we'll go up. I don't know, this way? Get the feeling I won't be attacking any pirate bases in this thing like I normally do. But it can't be helped. I mean, oh! We got laser fire over there. Finally. Those lasers tend to not like to attack. Okay. So how do we go up this hill? Will it go up fine? Okay. It is actually pretty nice. I don't think it's got enough power. It seems to be struggling. But look at the suspension on this thing. By throwing a rotor in there. It helps, you know, keep it less stiff. A bit more... Suspension-y. Uh oh, uh oh, uh, wheels, 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 wheels. Wheels out, need more power, need more power, need more. Uh, I think I've done the wrong thing. Okay, so there's not enough power in this thing to get up a hill like this. I think when I click strength, I've just stiffened the suspension. I guess I'll be finding out if it'll smack around a bit. Nope. Huh. Okay, so it does have a little problem. It can't go up two steeper hills or well, with something like that you know if if worse comes to worse it doesn't take much effort just to throw in a tiny thruster you know to help give it a speed boost you know although i probably wouldn't stick a tiny thruster on there that would just be asking for trouble maybe here on the heavy armor go like that and then like that yeah, <laughs> right in between the two ships, that'd be great. And with that on there, oops, wrong one. With that on there, suddenly you don't have so much trouble. Is that thruster even working? No, because it's on a rotor, it's not going to work on there, is it? My mistake. Oh, but it does help stop it from going falling backwards. Wait, does it now suddenly have a little bit of power enough to actually climb the hill thanks to that backwards road to prevent- I mean, backwards thruster preventing it from falling backwards? I don't know. Let's just try full powering it and see if it actually manages to make up the hill. I love the suspension on this thing though! Where it just moves with the ground- Ah, oh, here we go. Here's our problem. It just doesn't want to work. It needs more power. Power that I don't have for it. 
But if I had actually put that thruster in the right spot, then it'd probably have enough power. But I didn't put the thruster in the right spot. Okay, let's co go try removing that thruster. Then put the thruster in the right spot. Because this thing is awesome! It's like if I didn't actually build a giant or awesome, super killer base, mobile base, it sounded like this would actually be pretty dang awesome for actually traveling. Oh, they're all half blocks. Okay. Sound like this would actually be pretty awesome for traveling around on you, I mean. A nice little mobile base with some freaking awesome suspension. I mean, oh my god, those, that suspension is really cool. To just split it in half like that. And you know, then if you actually threw on some parachutes on here, so that way you know, it's safe. Cause, cause this is just so small and lightweight. Could imagine this going pretty well. I mean, look how much angle it can climb when you throw in a couple thrusters just because this is so small and lightweight. Of course, you know, once you actually filled up the inventory and refineries and stuff, that might be a little bit of a problem, but just look at how nimble this thing is. I mean, with my own mobile base, you can easily see the problems in how having a stiff frame can cause some serious problems. Like little bumps and cracks and stuff like that can really ruin your day. But having that little rotor there, making like an extra sort of suspension, really makes driving around on those rough hills and stuff really smooth. Let's see how far I can make it over there before I actually blow up or something like that. Die, potato! Yes! This is what you get for picking on me! This is what you always get for picking on me. Haha, take that, how beast. Look at it move, this is so cool. Oh my god, it's so nimble. I am loving this thing, the turn on it and everything. Oh wow, Parker Server, you really made a nice little base. I mean, sure, you know, I've obviously given a little modification. But you know, everyone modifies their own things when they actually, you know, want to actually build them. They're like, you know, I wish this thing had this and I wish this thing had that. And they give it a slight modification. And you know, even without the thrusters, it's pretty cool. I mean, sure, it struggles with hills and all that, but this is amazing. I don't think I'll um, fight the pirates because the missiles will destroy it super quickly. Instead, I'll have fun by going up a ramp and then off the cliff. Ooh, 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 ooh. Look at it! It's so smooth! That would have destroyed my other ship. Oh my god, it's such a smooth drive. I think I'm about to get missiled anyway. Uh oh. Well, poop. <laughs> you know what? I didn't drive off the cliff too well, did I? Oh, that's a very straight cliff, ain't it? Ha! Huh. I didn't drive off the cliff too well, but it still worked. It's an interesting sight to see. Okay, without thrusters on it, how well would this go? Uh, would it be able to make it up this tiny little hill here? I'm pretty sure it would. And the thrusters ain't too... that. I mean, the, the steering isn't that bad, you know? I just, you know, threw the thrusters on it because it certainly makes life a whole lot easier for going up hills. I just love the suspension on this thing. It's awesome. Okay, we're about to find just how durable this thing is if it accidentally gets shot at by an actual base. Or some crazy marauders with missiles and machine guns. Um, I think I'm about to lose my cockpit. Uh oh. Uh <laughs> How is my cockpit still alive? <laughs> ah no, my cockpit! Ah, I'm flying! 
Okay, it's done for. This is so cool. Gotta love it. Fight back! Fight back, Gatling Gun! Oops. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to. I love you! Come back to me! Now, there's something really charming about having little driving bases. They're really cool, you know what? Be awesome to see more of them. I'm always super happy when I actually find one on the workshop. They're the best. Anyway, guys, if you guys enjoyed this episode of Shipyard Showcase, showcasing an awesome tank, vehicle, mobile base thingy, well, you know what to do. You hit that like and subscribe button, or you share with your friends. Otherwise, I'll see you all next time. Bye! Ah, no, my cockpit! Ah, I'm flying! Okay, it's done for. This is so cool. Gotta love it. Fight back! Fight back, Gatling Gun! Oops. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to.